All right, so since there's not much in the internet right now about setting up like a Velocity drone to the uh, FR Sky X10 or X10S, so I'm gonna help you out. Uh, let's start out by grabbing your X10 or X10S, turning it on. Welcome to OpenTX. Uh, my X10S right now is running a 221 the new OS so basically you want to actually create a new model and then from here uh, from here you actually go to the model setup I can't you can't really see it here we go so you go all the way down or the opposite way you want to turn off your internal RF and then you go to the trainer mode and go to slave slash jack make sure it's a channel and that's it for the radio and then you can set up your switches for like starting and all that kind of stuff but you can do that later you don't have to do it right now so from here you go to the sim make sure that your controller input is usb right here you're in the velocity drone and you're looking at the actions and controller and you want to assign your controller and you're gonna need one of these babies these this is the basically a K sim four, four all in one and I have mine set at number two is the G5 is the G7 all of the above and it's basically the second notch you want to put that into your computer and connect that cord to your DS, DSC port right back here with your controller. go sorry about that so now when I connected you can see my drone is actually working and everything but let's actually restore the default so that we can create you the actual channels so now right now my controller is not working this is probably a lot of you guys problem right here and here is where you actually need to assign your channels to these guys. So basically very, very simple. Set everything into middle. And then go up and I'll assign that channel to this access to or whatever radio that you have it set to. Same thing with roll, set everything to middle. And then then right there so you can actually take a look at the quad you can go up and down you see your throttles working your roll is working and you just keep on going down to the assigned channels here do a pitch and that working correctly and we'll do yaw Yaw, pitch, roll, and throttle. So that's basically it for uh, the basic simple uh, process of hooking this up. And see, you can see actually see the controller as K model simulator G4, G7, and all of the above. You can calibrate it too if you want to, but I don't usually do it. But that's it. And press done. And now we can actually go fly. I'll test it out. Ready to race.
Well, it's spectacular, but yeah. But that's basically it for the new setup. Uh, if you have any questions, just put it in the comments. All right, guys.